and welcome back to the show. And I'm joined with the lovely Lucy Hilbert. Hello. Hello, Lucy. Lovely to have you in the studio today. How are you? Great, thank you. Yeah. I have to say it's warm in here, isn't it? It is, just a bit, yeah. It's just a tad. You know what's happening, friends? There it goes. The hat's off. We're down to business, Lucy. So, Lucy, you're representing. Tell our viewers who you're representing today. Um, I work for a company called Marker & Marker. Um, we're representing Percy Publishing. Over publishing here. Company, the uh, publishing company of all these wonderful books you can see here. But um, we've been really, really busy this year. Incredibly busy. And we've all been run off our feet. It's really yeah. taken off, Percy Publishing. Yeah. This. Well, I've been watching it from last year, this year, yeah. and it's, it's, talk about Razor, it's going through the roof, isn't it? Yeah. Well, um, I do the PR for the company, so all the press releases, you know, all the promotion and everything, social media, stuff like that. And it has, it just has taken off in a massive way, because we've got such a massive diversity of authors as well. I mean, we've got um, true, true crime, um, we've got some fiction, some children's books, we've got an imprint company called the London Publishing House, which is... This one here, wow. the Rogues Gallery, that was an incredible event actually. I'm sorry I missed that, and that was only last week, yeah, wasn't yeah. it? I'm sorry I missed that, this looks stunning. The, the photography in this alone, yeah. such a heavy book, it's a yeah. hardback as well. You could work out with this book, friends, I'm not joking here, you really could. So this is the Rogues Gallery, Yeah. and, and as I say, I missed that, what was it like? Oh, it was fantastic. It's it's based around the DC comic book universe, so I don't know if you're into your comics, Batman and all that kind of stuff. Yeah, I was into the back in the day, like, <laughs> but I've moved on. <laughs> well, um, the author, put, because he's a creative director, he works in theatre and, and dance, um, he wanted to do a big, massive theatrical launch, so he did it at the Crypt Gallery in London. I got a sound team in, a lighting team, and basically turned it into Arkham Asylum, so any, any wow. comic book fans will know exactly what I'm talking about there. But um, it was fantastic. We had all of the characters from the book in there. It was like a like a live action. You know, you you go through and all the characters are kind of there in full costume. And it's quite scary actually. Right. <laughs> it went down really really well. Yeah. Everybody was really impressed. We had quite a bit of press coverage on it as well. So it's brilliant. Yeah. And it, it, at an event like that, it's all down to the lighting, really, isn't it? Do you know yeah. What way they light it up, and it can it can be some of it can be scary, can't it? Well, we were in a crypt, an actual crypt. A real crypt? Yeah, there was something like 500 bodies down there. And it was, before we had all the lighting and all the props and everything in, it was quite creepy. I mean, there's vaults and little nooks and crannies and stuff, and it was very dark. And yeah, like I said, very scary, and you could easily get lost in there. I mean, there was we found some gravestones in there and all sorts. But um, once he'd got all his props in and all the lighting done and everything, it just was completely transformed. It looked amazing. Any yeah. strange noises heard? Yeah, we had a soundtrack playing. So there was like screaming in the background, explosions, wow. things like that. So it was really, really good. <laughs> just the average to settle everybody down. And I see, I see a good friend of ours here. And it's, it's uh, himself. Good man, Kevin Paul. We're talking to him in London there Thursday night. Yeah. And a gentleman. So this, this is the level of books now. You're also... This is a book about, about Kevin Paul, the tattoo, celebrity tattooist, Ray Quinn, Razor Ray, we are talking to Ray in uh, January, yes. was the last time I yeah. was talking to him, yeah. um, behind bars with the crazy, there's a lot of good books here Lucy, yeah. Yeah. and they're all quality, I mean they're, they're proper books, they're, they're not. Well I mean um, Steve Wraith, the author of Craze Behind Bars, he um, actually had a, a launch event yesterday at Blind Beggar. Is that right? Yeah. Oh wow we. Yeah. Didn't know that Steve, I could have popped around and said hello to you. So big razor for Steve Wraith. <laughs> um, also, I met this man, Colin. Colin Chapman, Cold Call. Some so great covers, aren't they? Yeah, well Colin's been bouncing around a lot recently. I mean, he's he's had quite a lot of press coverage. He's actually, because it's um, adult crime fiction, and it's a little bit naughty. He's been featured in the Paul Raymond magazines. Very good. So yeah, he's been featured in Mayfair. Um, he was at the Porn Awards. We had, we were, we were yeah. at the PRP Awards, yeah, weren't yeah, we? Yeah. We all met up and had a good time, didn't yeah. we? Yeah. He's doing some filming at the moment, so you'll probably see Colin on TV next year. Very um, good, yeah. Colin. Keep us posted <laughs> now in the Bonder Show. Yeah. This well. is what the Bonder Show is about, Lucy. It's about promoting and, if you know what I mean, helping yeah, people out. Yeah. So there's a lot of good books there. And as I say, they're all quality, so this is keeping you going. Yeah. Every day of the week, basically, because you don't. You don't take Saturday or Sunday off, do you? No, no, no. I mean, and like I was saying before, because it's such a massive diversity. I mean, you've got 
we've got a separate um, publishing, an imprint company. This is uh, Puppy Print, so these are all the kids' books. So we've been doing quite a lot of work with the author of those. I mean, she's only young. She's um, called Lily, but she had a pen name of Hilda Poppet, and everybody thought she was an old lady. Oh. So when the, um, the press found out about that, they ran like a national story saying that actually this author is an 18-year-old girl when everybody thought it was an old lady. <laughs> so that was good. <laughs> so you range from stuff like that to um, Simon Chambers, who's an active mercenary. Oh. And his, you know, he's been featured on the British Forces Radio, he's done TV stuff. He's a really, really interesting guy. So yeah, we're... we're There's loads of them. Yeah. <laughs> absolutely. You run off your feet, aren't you, basically? Yeah, pretty much, yeah. And then, not as, as the PR lady, you have to attend all these events. Yes, yeah. Which is incredibly, incredibly fun. I love it. Well, obviously I saw you the other yeah. day. And it's, it is so diverse. There's so many different things that we do. I mean, um, Percy Publishing also sponsors a racing team called DA Motorsports. Oh, yes, yeah. I was looking at that, yeah. Yeah, they've done... And they're doing well, actually. Yeah, they've done really, really well this year. I think he's come second in his class this year. So That's right. So really, really well. I think it was fourth overall and second in his class um, for Daniel, the, the racing driver. But, yeah, he's done fantastically well. That's brilliant, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. So we go to all their all their races and everything. And so that's, that's living the high life now, yeah. aren't you? The racing. Once you get into the racing game, yeah. it's, it's fast, furious. But it's fun, isn't it? Yeah, really good fun. I mean, I didn't think, think I'd find it interesting at all, but I was there like, woo! <laughs> <laughs> you got right into it, Lucy. Yeah, yeah. that's great. So where does Percy Publishing, where does, where is it, it's not going to stop, that's what I'm saying, where is it going to stop, it's never going to stop, you guys are so busy. Yeah. And yeah. I was only in here, I'd say within two minutes, when I came in through the door and there was a phone going there, and there was a phone going <laughs> over there, friends. So the place is live, we've sort of turned the phones off a wee bit, haven't yeah, we? Yeah, we've had to for this interview. Just for these <laughs> interviews, for the banter show, friends, so it's all good, you know. So what, what else is, is going to happen then, Lucy, or have you, you haven't summed it all up yet, there's too much to sum up, isn't yeah, there? Yeah, there is. I mean, we've got a lot of authors and obviously each have their own things going on, there's loads of events coming up. I, I have no doubt in my mind at all that we'll be taking on new authors in the future and we'll just continue, continue to grow. From strength to strength. Yeah, I mean, um, yeah. I was writing a press release the other day about Percy Publishing um, and where they've started and, and how they've sort of grown. And um, you know, and it's just actually writing it and reading it myself, it is unbelievable in yeah. such a short space of time. And what has happened, yeah, it's incredible. <laughs> and then, but Clifford's on the ball. I have to have yeah. again, Razor Clifford, the man's on the ball. And there, we have the Percy logo, friends. Percy, the black Labrador. And Percy's actually here in the studio. Yeah. We've got a few photographs with Percy, <sighs> beautiful Mark Corrin. Mark Curran, you'd love this black Labrador, very shiny coat in it, you know. We've got a load of Labrador lovers back in Ireland, oh, so brilliant. yeah. Well, Lucy, it's been an absolute pleasure to have you, have you in the show, you know. And give give, give a big shout out to all our all. If you, do you want to give anybody a shout out now that you're here, any of your friends? Oh, or? um, well, seeing as Clifford's not here, I suppose I better give Clifford one. Yeah, <laughs> big shout out to Clifford. Well, I'll tell you what, Lucy, will you will you? Join me in a razor, so it's two on the right, look, the girl has a sort of two on the right, one on the left, and then just go razor. 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 From me and Lucy, friends, we're out of here.